All right, team mates. All right, so in this video, I'm going to show you how to save your scan results to a file. And this is actually useful if you're running a really long scan and you know you don't want to sit there and wait and look at the results. So you can run it, go off, go do something else, and just save it to a file. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to run a fast scan on my own. Let me just type this first, the newboston.com. So I'll show you guys the results of this first. So this is me without saving anything to a file. What it does is it returns all of this information. Now if I ever want to save that to a file, then what I can do is after this minus F flag is I can write minus O capital N. Now you can actually save files in a couple of different formats. N is just a regular text file. There's also, if you write minus O X, aux, well, I don't think they say aux, but this will save it to an XML file, but I just want it in a regular text file, so I'm just going to write minus O N, and then you just write the location and name of whatever file. So desktop, I'll just name this results uh, .txt, but you can name it whatever you want. So what this is going to do, if I hit enter, it's going to go through the scan again, and I'll show you guys something cool. So let me minimize this, and I know you guys can't see it's off of the recording area, but it just created this file right here. And if I open in LeafPad, then you see it took all of the results and plopped them in a nice file for us. So you can do whatever you want with that. Let me pop this up again. Now, another cool thing I want to show you guys, since I have time, is if you ever want to display uh, verbose or pretty much updates in real time, this has nothing to do with like affecting the performance or details of the scan. It's just kind of cool to look at. You can write minus V and the new Boston.com. And this just kind of, like I said, if you guys know what verbose means, I always like looking at this because I don't know, something nice to look at instead of just a blinking cursor while it scans. So boom roasted, there you go, verbose, more information in the terminal, easy enough.